I remember when I named a sketchbook The Empire. I've never liked sketchbooks. They always put me in a bind. They make me feel like I'm being observed by an audience from the future in a glass box. Preserved. I preferred loose pages in bright folders. Easy to delete. Back then I was quite passionate. When I could ignore my ego and use a sketchbook, I had one rule. Always spoil page one. This would make the book no longer perfect, and I would be able to think again. But on page one of The Empire, I broke that rule and wrote this instead. Anything and everything with the potential for beauty and greatness deserves to exist and belong here. No idea is too small, too big, or too bad. Just out of context. Some ideas may take days, others years. Some may need help and collaboration. Others may need investment, effort, support, and dedication. Some ideas will completely fail. Others will never leave this book. You may need to ask for help. This is okay. The world is expensive, but ideas are free. They are your currency. You can never have too many ideas, but you can hold on to them too tightly. Learning is curved. Don't be afraid to make mistakes. There will always be a story in growth. If you take too long, someone else will beat you to it. We are all in the same stream. Don't get to 60 and regret the ideas you never had the courage to try in time. The world will no longer make sense and you will no longer understand how to contribute. Finish what you start. Page 2 of The Empire. Life is about making and doing, not making do.